Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. What do you wear for passport photo? When preparing for a passport photo, the clothing you choose is crucial to ensure your photo meets the U.S. Department of State's requirements. Here are some key guidelines to keep in mind. Background and clothing. Color. The background of your passport photo must be white or off-white. To avoid blending in with the backdrop, it is recommended to wear a dark-colored shirt. Opt for plain colors over bold patterns to avoid any distractions. Type of clothing. You should wear clothes that you normally wear in your daily life. Uniforms, uniform-like attire, and camouflage clothing are strictly not allowed. It's also advisable to avoid wearing a suit, as you are likely to travel in more casual clothes. Avoid certain tops. Strapless tops or tank tops are not recommended, as they might make you look exposed if the photo is cropped too tightly. Instead, wear a top with a higher neckline or something that covers your shoulders. Jewelry. While jewelry is allowed, it's best to limit it to small, simple studs or a thin necklace. Overstated accessories can obscure your facial features or cause too much reflection. Glasses. You cannot wear glasses or sunglasses in your passport photo unless it is for medical reasons. If you must wear glasses, you need to provide a signed note from your doctor. Hair and makeup. Choose a simple hairstyle and opt for light makeup. The focus should be on your face, so avoid anything that might distract from it. General appearance. Ensure your photo is a true likeness of yourself. The photo must be taken in the last six months and it should be a clear image without any filters. Selfies are not accepted. Have someone take your photo or use a tripod. Additional tips. Stand in front of a plain background without shadows, texture, or lines. The background cannot be cropped out using photo editing software, which could alter the outline of your head, face, and neck. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning into our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.